All right, we got to show you guys. <laughs> oh my goodness, sir. What are all those? Tell the people. There's a, these are bands from Alaska. A lot of brant, pintail, a couple of mallard. Yeah! <laughs> what up, y'all, and welcome back to another one. I told y'all we were coming to South Dakota. We're here. And check this out, yes. Oh, we are at Flatland Flyways. Your boy has wanted to come here for so incredibly long. Uh, this is one of the premier waterfowl guide services of South Dakota. Absolutely gorgeous. <clears throat> Real quick, I wanna thank uh, Federal Ammunition for uh, literally paying for the entire trip uh, for me and Beth to come up. Thank you, thank you, thank you to Federal. Awesome. Uh, Dan from Federal, uh, y'all met him last year when he came to Kansas to hunt. He's here, we got sportswoman Courtney here, we got my wife here, it's her first big trip. Uh, this is the first duck hunt. Uh, we're gonna be doing a uh, dry field hunt. Dry meaning lots of snow. Yeah, there's like six inches of snow on the ground. It's incredibly cold. Right now the wind chill is sitting at like negative two. It's, it's cold. But before we get on the road, before we start hunting, let's go take a peep at this lodge. It is immaculate, gorgeous. Oh yeah, oh yes. Well, take you for a little tour here. Yeah, oh, hold on a minute, we gotta show you this. Look at this beauty. Oh, what a gorgeous bird right there. Yeah, yeah, this place is so awesome. Beautiful. Look at the snows up top. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. It's gorgeous. Uh-huh. Not only that, but check out the view. This is a huge refuge behind the lodge, and it's just, it's breathtaking. Yeah, that's a huge refuge over there. That refuge, in fact, goes to like one to two million snow, goo snow geese like twice a year, or like a million and a half mallards once a year. It's crazy. Lots of dining. Um, all meals are served here. They're just, it's incredible. Let's go to Beth and I's room. Let's go see what she's doing. Now, where to be found? Okay, well, this is our room. Um, awesome, awesome. Just everything's so nice, you know, brand new and nice. Well, there you are. Hello. You ready to freeze your buns off? Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we left our food out in the car last night. What happened here? I shouldn't have brought food. I know I we should. I know. <laughs> I go on these trips. This is my fourth time up north this year, and it's not all provided all the time. Here at Flatland, everything's provided. Yeah. You're gonna have to bundle up, babe. Yeah, I'm not ready yet. You better so. get ready. We got like, like 30. What time is it? It's almost noon. Almost noon, we leave in an hour. Yeah. Midday duck hunt. Um, so the trick with the mallards up here is that they don't fly in the morning. Nothing flies in the morning. This morning it was, the wind chill was negative 11. So birds don't fly. Uh, they pick the warmest day or they, oh God. They, oh, wow. Birds fly during the warmest part of the day, which is like three o'clock. So the plan is uh, we're gonna set up at one o'clock and then we're gonna hunt all afternoon. Hopefully someone doesn't croak out Due to uh, me, <laughs> you can you are you think you're gonna be all right? I, I really don't know. I opened the door today and I was like, yeah, that's just not for me, yeah. not yet. The wind chill. Talking about the wind chill. The wind all day is like 18 to 23 mile an hour. It's gonna be cold. Well, here we go. We're ready. Are you ready, Courtney? I'm ready. Are you cold yet? Not quite yet. Give it about 20 minutes. Yeah. We're here. We're here, a little midday field action. Alex said that two greenies already landed in the spread. Yes, sir. Here we go, babe. You ready? Well, we're all laid down. Uh, we got snow covers on the lay down blinds. Big shout out to Brennan and uh, Alex. This, this little spread is incredible, extra tight. Uh, these mallards should be landing approximately five yards from my feet. So, close shooting. Let's uh, 
Let's hope it works out here. We're ready to go. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Love and life. Yeah, I'm glad cozy. you're here with me, babe. Yeah, it's pretty cozy. This just don't seem right. I don't have to call. <laughs> I don't have to run a dog. I don't have to go get a bird. I stay in my blind and I shoot. That's, I mean, it's nice. I, do, I sure do miss Frederick though. You loving it? Loving it, buddy. It's nice. Yeah, I miss Frederick too. Yeah, dude. Yeah. I'm just lucky. Mm -hmm. He's got to come next year. Dan, that's Dan from Federal. Y'all met him last year. His son uh, came and hunted with us last year, shot his first mallard. Mm -hmm. uh, man, good old memories. Working them hard, boys, working them hard. First bird's down. They came right up the gut. How's it going, Bob? Good. That's fun. Um, the hole is tiny, very, very tiny, and uh, it's a crazy little tight duck spread. All full bodies. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven spinners. Eleven spinners. Unreal. They just eat it up. Come right to it. I think you slapped that one. I don't know if I did. That wasn't me. <laughs> Y'all have been blowing up the comment section asking what shot size and choke I like this whole week out here in South Dakota this is what this is what Dan brought us thank you Daniel uh, one one shot three inch black cloud beautiful beautiful shot um, it's not what I'm using today today I'm actually using black cloud TSS this is a three inch uh, ounce and a quarter it's got BB and seven shot now if I'm if I'm right, the seven shot's tungsten, right? It is, yeah. The seven shot is tungsten and the BB is still uh, is steel. So it's a mixed load and uh, that's what I just clapped them birds with and I'll tell you what, it bangs. It bangs. <laughs> Those, uh, we had, those were two Susies and, and one Greenie. We're trying to pick out the green today. We're going to do everything we can just to shoot green. We do have a wood duck down though. That's special. In a, in a cornfield, in the snow. Oh yeah. Smash the thumbs up button, guys. Beth, she's behind the camera. <laughs> Looking pretty as ever, isn't she? First time in a lay down blind. I can't get over it. Shoot the green. Shoot that green. <laughs> Someone shoot him, Courtney. Shoot him on the ground. Still on the ground. Right in front of you. Yeah. He's a gray neck. <laughs> shoot him, Court. I will. Well, shoot him. That's the first. He did. <laughs> nice shot. <laughs> he did. That boy is a dead one. Thank you. He's got a six-inch <laughs> drop time. <today. laughs> Shooting them like turkeys out here, girl. What are you thinking? 
<laughs> that's awesome. Look what's on this one's leg. A feather. <laughs> I was like, no. No. Didn't get it on camera. Old Courtney. She shot a green wingtail. No way. In the field. In the snow. Let's take a look at her here. Nice head. Green wing too, I'll be darned. <laughs> well, with the snow on the ground, it's been nothing but uh, midday hunting because uh, it's the warmest part of the day and it makes it pretty unique because in Kansas, 80% uh, of our hunting, as y'all know, is in the mornings, you know, much colder up here. Uh, makes it really nice. It's really fun being able to sleep in. <laughs> I want to blow my call so bad. <laughs> Ooh, look at this single eating it. Nice shot, Dan. Beauty shot. Nice. What a good dog. What a good dog. Coop, he's uh, Alex's dog. Seven year old. Champion. That's uh. That's Daniel's. That's a good one. That's a beauty, dude. That's nice. How many curls he got back there? Three. Curls for the girls? Beautiful girl. Dude, he smoked him. Nothing wrong with that. No. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> well, Dan, you got to do the new trick. Pew, pew. Good job. That away. Boom. You got to get that one, okay? Yeah, you gotta, that is going to look stupid on the shot cam. I think you, you got to piece, piece of that, that one, one up, okay? <laughs> Tenderized. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Oh, did you, were you filming that? <laughs> you ready for the meat grinder, old Bobby? Boy, I mean. Holy Toledo's, is that a filled dead wall, eh? <laughs> is that the wall? That was definitely Winchester. Yeah, oh, God, yeah. Must oh, look, wad. the wad's in it, Dan. Oh, no way. The wad's in it. <laughs> yes. Oh. We shoot them a long way here in South <laughs> <laughs> I hope Beth caught that on, on the camera here. I'm, I'm pretty sure the shot cam did, but th look at this. Yeah, look, he's got a wad in him. That's crazy. That was a close shot, dog. Nice shot on the right. Here we go. You weren't lying, you worked them, boy. You just let them work. That was nice. That was beautiful, actually. Gorgeous. Oh, yeah. I'm good. Get that feet up. Yeah, I got I got it. I got it. I all the old pictures you see with Texas rags were originated. Yeah. yeah. Right there where I'm at. I'll be damned. The speck of Ellie hunting was the best in the world. Now it's a number. So. Yeah. It's so hard for you.
through the greeny door. <laughs> I was just, well, I was waiting for someone else to see it. She's dead. <laughs> I'm like, oh, hey, Al. Yes, you son of a. Hen mallard. That's a nice looking field. Alright, shoot, shoot the mallard in front. Shoot him, shoot him. Well, big shout out to Babe filming with her big camera. It looks good. Yeah, that's Thank you. If you guys think best big camera shots are juicy, better than, Bob. better than my oh, they're way better than mine. Smash a thumbs up button for Beth. Come on now, her first hunt out here, extra cold, and she's a trooper. I love her. All right, we got to show you guys. <laughs> oh my goodness, sir! What are all those? Tell the people. There's a, these are bands from Alaska, a lot of brant, pintail, a couple of mallard. Some of them are almost 30 years old, 27, Wow. 24. I have never seen a lanyard with that many tarsals on it. Well, That's unreal. unreal. Thank you. It's a, what are you going to do, do with that one day? I don't know. You better bury it with you. <laughs> <laughs> I would. I would. <laughs> It's a, it's a lot of fun, a lot of good memories, really good. A lot of good memories. I can I can only imagine. All right, let's get down. Get down, boys. There we go. What do we end up with? 22, 22 total, I believe. I think 22 total. Uh, do it. 22. Uh, green heads. A couple hens. Uh, wood ducks, teal, a widgeon. That's a good bag. Yeah. Oh, a gad wall. How many is that? That's six species? I think so. Six. That's awesome. It's a good mix bag. Yeah. What are you doing in here? Life of <laughs> social media content creator. <laughs> <laughs> are, you, are you in here taking pictures of the federal ammo, huh? I'm over here trying to help explain to people who might be new to waterfowl hunting what shot size I use because I know that that's like a big question for people. So I'm trying to figure out how do we make this look interesting and engaging <laughs> so that people will retain the information. I was just like, hi, welcome to our lives. Right. <laughs> it's, we all do it. We all do it. It's part of, it's part of the job, right? But I uh, just got done editing up this video for y'all. I hope, I pray. I hope you guys liked it. Um, Beth whipped out the big camera and awesome footage. Sorry for the wind noise. Uh, there's really nothing that I could do about it. I have this big camera, uh, sorry, big mic and the wind yesterday, it was whipping over 20 miles an hour most of the day. But today it's warm. I bet you it's like 40, 35 degrees probably right now. Yeah, the snow is melting. It's absolutely gorgeous up here. Their property, the entire lodge, everything about it. Alex, okay, Alex Russo is the owner of Flatland. And uh, we had a huge conversation last night. And it's probably one of the most meaningful conversations I've had about waterfowl hunting and guiding, guiding in general. He, he really uh, shed some light on, um, on a lot of things uh, just to help me get ready for guide season, you know? It's it's gonna be a, a huge difference in my lifestyle. Uh, I'm gonna be way busier. And most of all, I'm gonna be trying to please satisfy my clients. So big shout out to Alex, man. Heck of a dude. Your mom's amazing, your dad's amazing. All of, uh, all the, all the help here. So welcoming. Guys, first of all, I, I wanna give a huge shout out to Federal. Uh, for bringing us up here. Federal Ammunition. They have always been in my corner and I will always be in their corner. Not only for the fact of their ammunition is the best on the market, but they have 
quality. Not quality products, but quality in people. They put time into people, and um, without them, this trip wouldn't have happened. So, <sighs> big shout out to Alex and Flatland Flyways, man. If you guys are looking for a trip of a lifetime, a, a waterfowl experience, not just, it's not about the killing, you know what I mean? Yesterday we shot 22, 23 birds, which is epic for me. I loved it. It is a really good hunt. But even if we only would have shot one, what I'm trying to get to you guys is like the experience. It's about the experience. It's not about how many times you pull that trigger. It's not about how many dead birds you have on the ground. It's about what experience you're gonna take home with you and you're gonna remember for the rest of your life. That's important. That's the most important thing in waterfowl hunting. It's not important to actually shoot the bird. Snow's falling. You know what I mean though? That's that, that shouldn't be crucial and it, it's not it's really not but um Hope you guys are enjoying the videos. We should be having at least two or three more coming your all y'all Y'all's way. I'm trying to squeeze in a pheasant hunt up here. I bought my license I really really want a pheasant hunt. So if you guys want to see a pheasant hunt drop a comment down below and let me know a uh, little heads up all of the ducks thermal hoodies are all back in stock all colors and we're doing a Halloween sale a big discount you don't want to miss it fires up the day before or on halloween i believe don't miss that sale but stick around we got some more coming thank you all for being here subscribe if you haven't but until next time that is gonna look that. stupid on the shot cam i think you, you gotta pick, pick that, that one up okay <laughs> Weird, <bud>. tenderized <laughs> hello <laughs> oh did you were you filming that